Oh, God. I can't stop smiling. I feel like a real idiot, but this is wonderful. Um, thank you to Pedro and Patricia. That's very sweet, very generous of you to speak on my behalf. Um, I'd like to thank the guy that I just met, <laughs> the head of the chamber, of the Hollywood Chamber of Commerce, and also uh, search like pictures for uh, supporting this event. Needless to say, yes? I'm going to be going in and out of this because they stole my speech somehow. Um, you know, needless to say, when I was a kid, growing up in Appleton, Wisconsin, and believe me, I couldn't envision this day of getting a star on the Walk of Fame. But you know, I, w I must say that when I looked at the list of names of people that have stars, the little town that I come from, Appleton, Wisconsin, it's maybe a town of 70,000 people now, someone else from that town has a star. Yeah, wow. And his name was Eric Weiss. Do you know who that is? Maybe you know him better from, by the name Harry Houdini. Ooh. So I'm, I'm in good company. And then I look down, Clifton Fadiman. Do people know who Clifton Fadiman is? He's not a movie star, but I know who he is. And Jonathan Winters, fantastic. And the location, fantastic. Anyway, um, you know, when I think of the names, uh, you know, they're, they're people that I've watched all my life, some people I've worked with, um, some people I don't know, admittedly, and, you know, a lot of people that I've admired. So it's real humbling uh, to be here and to be part of this. <laughs> Uh, I love making films, and you know, it's arguably the uh, most collaborative of art forms. So they did some shout outs, but I, I'm really touched when people show up uh, for this for me. People from my. Thank you. That's really sweet. Not only the fans, but also the people that I've worked with that are part of my creative life. So bear with me, I'm going to shout out some people, okay? Uh, Alex Ho, who is one of my oldest friends, producer. I've worked with him several times. Walter Hill, who, who gave me my first studio job, and I worked with 40 years later, uh, recently, in his Western Dead for a Dollar. Guillermo del Toro was here. He's, uh, who else? Vim. Uh, Vim, who I've, I'm lucky enough to know and actually have worked with, and his films have had such an impact on my life. So thank you for coming, Vim. Um, oh, Sean Baker, Samantha Kwan, who we made a film called The Florida Project together, a beautiful film. And then Pedro, uh, he told you we worked uh, in China together and we became great friends of Zhang Yimou film. And Patricia, directed, I've, she's an actress that I've always admired, but uh, she, she then, she's been directing and she directed her first feature and just recently finished it. I'm coming. Uh, just recently finished it. Don't worry. Yeah, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, she, she was a beautiful director. Uh, it's a movie called Gonzo Girl. I don't know when it's coming out, but uh, thank you for coming. And you were fantastic. Really confident and strong under really sometimes difficult uh, conditions. What was that? Um, and we have my co-star from that film. Yes, Kami Marong, please. Yes, very talented young actress. Um, and then, I've got a bunch of people from Poor Things here. And if you haven't seen Poor Things, go out and see it. Uh, won the best picture at the Golden Globes last night, which is great. So we have screenwriter Tony McNamara. Thank you, Tony. And uh, Jerskin is not here. Composer. 
the bum he said he was going to come. But he, he, he makes very beautiful music for the film. Uh, we've, got, oh, we've got the producers, Andrew Lowe and Ed Guiney. We've got Searchlight's David Greenbaum. And then, I don't know where the hell Rami is. He was supposed to come. Empty seat. But Mark came. Mark, my buddy from Poor Things, came. Thank you, Mark. Okay, I'm kind of going on. I'm going to wrap it up really quick. Uh, I just want to say, uh, you know, it's wonderful to be part of that, uh, this community of artists and entertainers, people that, by sharing their experience, imagining other, others' perspectives, telling stories, and musing on what is, was, and most importantly, could be, they make us feel closer to each other and connect us, creating an important human dialogue particularly needed in these detached, technology-driven, and divisive times. So I'm glad to be with people like this, and we're making something, and hopefully we're making this a better world somehow. <laughs> Just lastly, I'd like to thank my management team, Frank Frateroli, and Charles Mastro Pietro, my agent, Elan Ruspoli, my PR, Brenna Rifkin. Am I popping every time on the mic? Okay, I'm doing okay. Okay, and Selena, Madeline Sakai. <laughs> How'd I do? And finally, thank you. I'm almost done. Uh, finally, thank you to my wife, filmmaker and musician, Jada Cola Grande. <laughs> who teaches me gratitude and reminds me not to spit on my luck. Thank you. Thank you for coming. <laughs>